It's late April and we got a cold snap. Temperatures got down to below freezing for a few hours and any time that wheat is from boot stage or beyond, it's susceptible to cold damage at those temperatures. So it's a week later and I am scouting for the damage. What I'm looking for today is any bending, any bleaching or any drying out of any of the plant parts. Now, of course, I'm going to be looking at my low areas of the field, but I'm also going to be looking at areas of the field that dry out more quickly. Water is a temperature moderator. So anytime we have a field that dries out more quickly, it's also going to cool off more quickly during a cold snap. And if I had drought stress in any of those areas, those plants are going to be more prone to cold damage. So you can see here this grain head is curved and the kernels on the inside of this curve are going to be damaged. Some people will call this uh, a janky head where it's kind of crooked. Another thing you might see is getting trapped in the boot. So these leaves on the outside, when they get cold damage, they will become, the cells will become rigid and the head will not be able to emerge properly. And those leaves on the outside will constrict those grains from being able to fill properly. Then you'll see in this picture, uh, this bleaching of the top of the head. This upper area is completely dead, but you may, might be able to get some grain out of the bottom part here. Now remember, even if we do have some damage out here, our secondary tillers are really gonna start working harder to compensate for that. 